Alright, hey guys, this is uh, Luke P here. That was loud. <laughs> um, so, today is going to be Sonic Advance 1. Uh, yeah. So, I just thought it was kind of nonsensical to do the second one at first. So, here's the first one. Um, so. Oh, it's X, okay. I hope the screen is good too. From my from my point of view, it's kind of off center, but maybe we can like tilt this a little bit. Okay, I think that's still gonna be okay. <coughs> All right. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of memories with this game. Um, you know, especially, like, from the Game Boy. Because, um, <clears throat> you know, I did actually used to have the real thing, but then um, now I have to do <laughs> an online thing. As with all these games, because... Um, yeah, I never had a Genesis either, so... But yeah, it is... Um, it's really fun. If you haven't played this game before, you should definitely try it out. Um, and especially uh, this first zone, it's it's so like peaceful and like it really does give you that beachy feel um, because you know the water in the background looks so nice and like I know it looks really pixely, but they actually did the art pretty well on this stage, I'll have to say. Alright, let's get these speed shoes. And, uh, skadoosh! <laughs> I know I did that really bad, but, um, that was a little, uh, Cabana Mini 456, um, reference. <laughs> for our Sonic viewers. <clears throat> and, if you actually do manage to get all the way up there and do that, um, that little, <clears throat> I don't know what it's called, uh, up here. Like, you can actually run on top of that thing. It's really cool. Wait, hold on. See, there we go. Okay. I always thought that was fun. All right. And we finished um, Act 1. Also, if you go in the, the menu to pick the levels, because I think you can do that, um... For the zones, it, it always showed zones 1, 2, 3, and 4, and whatever, I think. And that always confused me, like... Because later, I realized that each zone actually had a name to it. Like, this is Neo Green Hill. Um... And... Like... So that led me to think that, like, all Sonic zones didn't have a name. They were just, like, 1, 2, 3, and then I was... When I played the Genesis games, I was like, oh, they do. <laughs> I don't know, that was just interesting. Because it would be really confusing if they did call it, like, Zone 1, Act 1, or Zone 2, Act 1, or something. But, yeah. Shoot, those crabs always get me. Also, I do kind of want to spend time in this zone because, you know, it's one of the best. Um, I don't want to just zoom through. Come on, dude. <laughs> That's another thing about this game. The enemy placements are not generous at all. Like, you just get screwed over by bees and crabs all the time. Alright, I remember there's a secret over here, so let's... Get this. Get them coins. Or rings. Sorry, they're not coins. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Um, oh, I see a thing up there. But I don't think I can get it. I think it's one of those force fields that like, attracts rings. Nope, I can't get it. I don't know how you're supposed to do that. But let's go on. I'm glad that thing didn't get me this time. Whew. 
Also, if you ask me, uh, Sonic does look really cool in this game. Like, I don't know, just how they designed him. Even though it's not much different than the other games, it's still, like, just his, his face, facial expression, excuse me, um, I think looks a lot better than, like, in Sonic 1, he was just, I think he looked too serious in that one, I don't know. So, this is our first boss. Um, it's pretty easy, you just... <laughs> You just keep jumping at him. It's not really that difficult. As I say while I'm losing ranks. <clears throat> Alright, come on. There we go. Alright. to secret base and this one is pretty cool too um the music gives you kind of a you know secret spy or something vibe um i don't know th that's just always what i think of or like one of those detective shows <laughs> i don't know because it's like well, i don't exactly know where you're where you are i guess like I, I don't know. Just an underground place? I, I don't know how to describe it. But yeah, it has a lava and like bouncy stuff all around. <laughs> Oh, and for the first zone we were doing, um, yeah, it is called Neo Green Hill. Um, and actually, I believe that was the beta name for Aquatic Ruin Zone in Sonic 2. And I just think that's interesting. Um, so that's one interesting fact about it. And so Neo means new, right? Um, so, I guess it's supposed to be, like, an improvement on the first Green Hill Zone, which, I mean, I could guess to kind of see, because it has a ton of different routes and stuff, um, and it does look better, it, it really does give you more of that, um, feeling of what the zone was originally supposed to give you. These things are so annoying. <laughs> Yay, we got invincibility. <laughs> we always gotta sing the theme song when we get it. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Whoops. Did not mean to do that. Yay. I don't think I've ever gotten that life before. It's cool. Yeah, there's a bunch of hidden stuff around here.
And uh, next video, I'm not sure if I want to do Sonic Advance 3 because, yes, there is one. Um, but I never, it never really, like, interested me because, and pl plenty of people have talked about this, like, the level design is, it's pretty weird, um, especially the first level, it, it doesn't even seem like a first level, it's just, I don't know, you're, like, in the city, and, like, the enemy, like, where the enemies are placed are, like, they're a lot worse. Um, I know I was just talking about the ones in Green Hill Zone, but, like, in that one, it's, like, you can't even speed up at all. It's that bad. <laughs> and, um, how the, okay, so there's the buddy system, right? So I have to pick a partner, and then I think you have to rely on them for, to get through certain parts of the level or something. I don't know. And then, um, what else? Oh, yeah, it's like you have to... You do have a choice between which level to go into, but it's... I don't know. I, it's just different. I, <laughs> I never really cared for it. So, I don't think we'll be doing Sonic Advance 3. I don't think any of y'all will be upset about that, though, because... Um... Like, I don't think many people watch these... <laughs> <laughs> um, these playthrough things, but I could be wrong, but, um, just for what I've seen, uh, the numbers of views and stuff. And this is, uh, Casino Paradise, I believe. It's, it's alright, um, not as good as Casino Night, and it's mediocre. No. <laughs> Sorry. <about that. laughs> I know that laugh sounded weird. We could probably get through a ton of this game if we let the video go on. Because these are actually really easy to speed through. Um, really speedrunner friendly. And yeah, comment down below if, you know, you ever played this game and like, um, I don't know, just share your opinions about it, um, cause, and I do read comments, um, in case I've never said that before, yeah, I do read them, um, I don't always respond because, um, like, there, there is a possibility that I won't see it, I guess. Um, and also, what was the other thing I was gonna say? Uh, my mind is just, I can't remember anything today. All I know is there is like one comment that I didn't respond to. Either I was like busy or I just forgot, I don't know. But most of the time, I will comment back. Alright. 
This boss is pretty difficult if you don't know how to do it. Basically, you just have to hit the real Eggman and not the the fake metal one. Dang the Oh, missed him. There we go. Get the frick out. <laughs> or if I was Gordon Ramsay, I would say, Frick off. <laughs> Seriously though, Hell's Kitchen is, <laughs> it's a great show. <laughs> uh, I watched it a little bit, like, um, a few weeks ago. Just, like, clips on YouTube. It's, it's really funny. Because <laughs> he, like, blows up at everyone. Anyways, I I'm sure you guys know what it is, but... If I was in that show, I wouldn't last, like, two seconds. <laughs> and it is, it is still going, right? I, th I think it is. I know it started a long time ago. But... And I don't think uh, Gordon is, like as strict on them as he was at the start. Um, which is odd. I guess, like, <laughs> he's gotten older, so he, like, just decided, okay, I'm, I'm done blowing it up at people. <laughs> which is understandable. Oh, okay, I do want to talk about this. Um, I've been thinking about doing, um, like, a video um, with somebody else along with me. Um, just as, like, a short co-op thing. Um, or, or it could just be me playing and then they just talk in the background. Um, I'm not sure who I would get to do that, though. Um, I mean, I could think of a few people, but, um, yeah, just let me know if you want to see that. Um, and I, I'm, nothing's planned yet, I'm just, you know, throwing out ideas. I'm not even sure if it's gonna happen anytime soon, but... And we are already on, um, I think it's called Ice Mountain Zone, Act 2. So we are flying by these stages. Yeah, at that part, you want to be careful of those, um, those enemies that come out at you. What I always do is I just spin dash so they can't hurt you. No. <laughs> See, I just, I just told you guys what to do and then I don't take my own advice. Get that invincibility, yeah! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do my best Sonic impression right here. <laughs> hey, we should do that again sometime! <laughs> uh. 
Uh, remember that from uh, Smash Bros. Brawl? Yeah. <laughs> what What is happening? Okay. I was trying to jump and I was like, what? <clears throat> I was pressing the, um, the A button, not the X one. But yeah, I think I do a perfect Sonic impression. <laughs> not really. I'm a lot better at the, um, what's his name? Somebody Griffith. Um, not Andy Griffith. <laughs> um, Jason Griffith, that's, that's who it is. Um, I'm a lot better at his voice than anyone else's, I think. Because Ryan Drummond's is like, um, it, it's kind of confusing because... It sounds like a kid, but... And I can't really do a kid's voice that well. Um... Oh no, we need air. Yes, there we go. And the other... Um... What is his name? Roger Craig Smith. Um... It sounds like a 40-year-old man, <laughs> pretty much because he is. Um, and, you know, that's, that's hard to do. Because um, it's, like, nasally and stuff. And then Ben Schwartz, you know, we haven't seen much of him, so <laughs> I can't really uh, judge that. Are we almost done with this boss? There we go. Alright. Um... What else? Oh yeah, there's Julia White. <laughs> and, um... I don't know, I could try. Um... Hey, kids! Uh... <laughs> Be sure not to... Let other people touch you, or whatever he says. <laughs> that was so bad, I know. <clears throat> Man, th those episodes were so corny. And while we're talking about Sonic Voices, um, I believe Cry uh, Roger Craig Smith is, like, pretty much done. Uh, because, you know, we did get Ben Schwartz in the Sonic movie. And I think he's voicing him again for the uh, sequel. And I don't know if it's official because I haven't heard much about it, but... I mean, it makes sense that he would stop doing his voice because it's been, like, 11 years or 10 years. And that's usually how long a person lasts for Sonic's voice. Um, am I sad to see him go? Not really, because... Um... I didn't really care for it. Um, I didn't care for his interpretation of how Sonic should sound like. Um, I liked Jason a lot better, um, and, what was I gonna say? Um, but Ben Schwartz, I, as I said before, I haven't heard much of him, and like, we haven't seen him any games, I don't think. Uh, so we'll just have to wait for that to happen <clears throat> before I say anything else about him. But from what I think so far, I, th I think he's just okay. You know, not the best. Um, but, you know, if, if you think he's good, then, you know, that's fine. I'm not gonna judge you on your Sonic voice opinion. <laughs> I 
and Griffith's voice, I think, was just really soothing and um, really fit the teenage era of Sonic um, back in like the 2000s. I don't think um, they did any voice acting for this game, though. Yeah. In Sonic Advance 3, there is, though. But again, we're not trying that. Because <laughs> the game is garbage. At least that's what I think. And I'm not saying that there's not any good parts in the game. I do like how they reference Green Hill Zone in it. And I think uh, the layout of that was good, but I'm just saying overall, I don't think the game is like really eye-opening or whatever. All right, how much time are we at here? 26, sorry. <laughs> this game is really hard to finish, by the way. Because one time I did get to Egg Rocket Zone, and dude, it was like impossible. I'm not even like joking around here because, um, I just. I think I had a decent amount of lives when I started it, and then, like, snap your fingers, they're all gone. Like, there's just a lot of bottomless pits, and it's not always clear where you're supposed to go, so that kind of screws you over. Um, and, of course, there's a lot of enemies, you know, that's expected. Um, but yeah, I've never finished this game, and... I'm not really embarrassed about that either because it's just so difficult. You know, ask anybody, they'll say, that's played the final zone, they'll say it's unfair because it's just what it is. Um, but, yeah, I do like the the first half of this game. You know, it's it's pretty easy and not like it's not like they're feeding you speed and rings you still have to work for that but um <clears throat> in the earlier levels um it's just you have a better time and you can you know kind of mess around and have fun which is <laughs> the point of a video game and we just lost our first life there was it was it our first life? I th think it was. I'll have to look back at the video. <laughs> if it's not, I'm gonna look stupid, but... <sighs> Alright. No, I keep doing that. Okay. Oh, shoot, that was, that was scary. The lag almost made me die. <laughs> you gotta admit, we're doing pretty good for... Um, Sonic Advance. <laughs> and the fact that I'm commenting during this entire thing. And the fact that I'm recording, which puts extra pressure on me. 
<laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> not really, though. It's not... It's not that bad, but... You get what I mean. And now we have Pink Knuckles. <laughs> I do not remember him being pink. Okay, so I think what we have to do is wait for him to do something. Wait, what? Wait. Oh no, we have no ring. Wait, are you supposed to hit him while he's in the air? I'm so confused. Oh, there we go. <laughs> well, never mind. <sighs> okay, I keep having to do that because... So yeah, I had forgotten how you actually beat this guy. But we're gonna try this again. And it's not that. So I was wrong about hitting him in midair. Oh, okay, I see, I see. All right. You gotta hit him while he's descending. Alright, gotcha. Yes! Oh yeah, this guy throws stuff at you. Okay. No! Get the ring! Dude! Come on, do something. Alright. Gotta watch out for the bullets. There we go. Okay, I think we're done with him. Yep. And goodbye, Angel Island. I don't know why it's called Angel Island, because it has nothing to do with the Sonic 3 level. Well, except it's in the air. Okay. Now we are on to the infamous Egg Rocket. I love the background, my goodness. It looks so good. Looks like they kind of just took a picture of a real life place and just pixelized it. Okay. There's that stupid diamond. I died to that so many times with it throwing its uh, purple stuff. See, because I thought, oh, okay. See, before, like, years ago, I, w I kept hitting it with... I kept hitting it when it was, like, closed in. And that's why I died so many times on this level. I remember that. So vividly. And I'm... Not sure how far we're gonna get. I should probably end the video soon though.
I think if we die one more time, then I'll, I'll quit the video. But for now, we got the shield, so that's good. Have to stop sooner. No. Okay. All right. Let's see where this takes us. Again, I'm probably gonna be more quiet during this time because I'm trying to focus more. All right. Is that? I thought that was a death trap. And I don't really want to try it. But I guess I'm gonna have to? Yeah, okay. Wait! Oh, we've already... Huh? Wait. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, guys. But anyways, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and all that. Um, and yeah, see you guys next time.